Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a gravity coil game pass in Roblox Studio. But before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the channel. We're almost at 2,000 subscribers, and at 2,000 subscribers, I'm going to be doing a Robux giveaway you're not going to want to miss. So, let's get started. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into replicated storage and add in a remote event, and we're just going to name this to give. Then in server script service, we're going to add in a script and we're going to call this coil game pass or whatever you like. And we, in our script, we could do local MPS is equal to game colon get service marketplace service and local game pass ID is equal to just some quotation marks for now. Then we could do game dot players dot player added colon connect a function and we can do player. Then we can do if MPS colon user owns game pass async player dot user ID dot game pass ID. Then make sure you spell player correctly. Game dot server storage dot gravity coil. And that's going to be the name of our tool, which we don't have yet, but we will get to in a second. Colon clone dot parent. And that's going to equal player colon wait for child backpack then we can copy this whole line right here and then in here we're going to do starter gear then we can do game dot replicate storage dot give dot on server event colon connect a function player again and then we can go ahead and just copy both these lines here and paste them there and now we can look for our gravity coil. Then we're gonna say no to put in this starter pack and we're gonna put it into server storage. And we're just gonna make sure that this name matches the name that we have for it in our script. All right, and now we can publish this place to Roblox. So we can go ahead and give it a name and a description and go ahead and create. And then you can go to Roblox and go to the create tab. And then we're gonna click right here on the place that we just published. Then we can go to store and add a pass. Then you're gonna choose a file, give it a name and a description, go ahead and preview and then verify upload. And then it'll show up here and we can click on it. All right, and then you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and copy the ID from up here and just paste it right in there. And we're actually gonna change the period to a comma for right here. And also make sure that the parents are all capitalized. Now we can go ahead and test it out. And as you can see, when we spawn in, we have the coil. And if I were to go back to the game pass page, and go ahead and delete it from my inventory and test the game out again as you can see we don't spawn in with it and that is how you make a gravity coil game pass in roblox studio if you did like this video and it helped you please don't forget to give it a like and subscribe and i will see you next time